Now to Spain and the uh, Cumbre Vieja a volcano on uh, the Canary Islands shows no sign of slowing down more than three weeks since it first erupted. Author authorities on La Palma have issued new evacuation orders as lava starts to flow in new directions, threatening towns that had previously escaped damage. Roads, walls, nothing can stop the rivers of lava. After weeks of living in the shadow of Cumbre Vieja's endless eruptions, people on the Spanish island of La Palma are shaken and exhausted. Thousands of residents have already fled. Now hundreds more have to abandon their homes as molten rock forges a new path towards their town. I'm getting things out of my aunt's house before this demon arrives. The path the lava is flowing leads to my aunt and grandparents' house. We're trying to get out what we can because you can't fight against nature. Over the weekend, part of the volcano's cone collapsed, sending a lava flow in a new direction and destroying what was left of a small town. An industrial zone has been swallowed up, releasing toxic gases. And yet more eruptions and new lava streams are threatening other populated areas. Honestly, I'm scared. I've cried because it's sad to run away, leaving everything behind, leaving the house. But the most important thing is our own life. Even where the lava hasn't reached, ash coats everything. Made up of rock and glass particles, it's dangerous to breathe in. La Palma's economy is suffering too. Businesses and fruit plantations have been wiped out. And after weeks of restricted access, the island's tourism industry is stumbling. The last time Cumbre Vieja erupted, it lasted just over three weeks. But three weeks on this time, and there's still no end in sight.